We do want to share with you tonight the encouraging numbers in New York State's fight against COVID-19. Governor Cuomo's office announced today that we had a daily COVID test positivity rate below 1% for the 24th straight day. Hospitalizations dropped to 418. That's a new low since March 16th. And there was one COVID-19 death in the state yesterday. There were no deaths in the city. That's the lowest single day death toll in months. A major clinical trial is now underway across the country to test an experimental COVID vaccine. One of the testing centers is at Hackensack University Medical Center, which was hit especially hard with the virus. Investigative reporter Sarah Wallace says volunteers are being recruited. Meet the first patient at Hackensack University Medical Center in this final phase of a nationwide clinical vaccine trial that will involve 30,000 people in 90 study locations. Dr. Ihor Sachak just happens to also be the chief of research at Hackensack, where a total of 300 volunteers are being recruited for a two year trial involving a COVID vaccine developed by Moderna, a biotech company in Massachusetts. It's all in cooperation with the National Institutes of Health. I feel that uh, uh, it's important that uh, I, I, I walk the walk, and, and why should anybody else volunteer? if I wouldn't volunteer. To be considered, volunteers must be over 18, not pregnant or breastfeeding, not had COVID, active infections, or certain bleeding or immune disorders. They are especially interested in high-risk patients. This is a double-blind study. Dr. Sacek and the rest of the recruits won't know if they get a placebo or the real thing. It's 50-50. But because the vaccine is made from a genetic code of the virus, it can't cause the COVID-19 illness. But what about possible side effects? It's just just like getting the flu vaccine, where you know you may feel a little achy, you know, a little bit uh, sore muscle where you got the injection. Uh, you might get a little bit of uh, not feeling well, but at the end of the day, uh, it is a it, it, this is a clinical trial to see is this an effective vaccine or not. Patients will get an initial injection and then another 28 days later, they'll be monitored throughout the trial. Doctors anxiously watching to see the role of antibodies. We are actually trying to see how much, what is the level of the antibody that forms in each patient and how long does it last? Um, and then during the illness visit, if they do develop COVID, does that antibody levels fluctuate? What happens to it? Reaction mixed to the idea of yeah. being a volunteer. Why wouldn't you not want to do it? But I mean, it's a lot of reasons why. I mean, it's a risk. Area, and I don't, I wouldn't want to take that risk. Absolutely. Absolutely. I think people should participate because how else are you going to find a solution for this problem? If you are interested in participating in the trial, go to coronaviruspreventionnetwork.org to find the nearest location to you. From Hackensack, Sarah Wallace, News 4 New York.